Okay, so what's going to happen here is some people are going to say, hey, I calculated the area for the tile and then I cut as long as you do it in meters squared make sure it's in meters in meters squared and I also took the area which they already gave it to us that was 32 meters squared right and I divided the two the area from the room and I divided by what area of one tile and I got 70 um I got something tiles I got the answer right and then I um added 10 percent and i got the, uh, the 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 total answer that's correct that's not wrong that's correct if you want me to do that you're gonna have to request me to do that but that is also correct as long as the tiles are not circular or whatever you're packing is not once what you're packing is circular never ever use the area so here we don't use the area when we have one of the shapes circular right make sure you don't do that so if the, if the tiles were circular we were going to put one tile there Use the diameter this way, use the diameter this way. But you can use the area because the shape allows it. Okay, so let's move on. We're going to go to 3.2.3. Show by means of calculation if Zeho's budget is enough to finish the tiling project. Okay, so we know how many tiles he's going to use. He's going to use 80 boxes, right? So we're going to, we're going to know how much the boxes are going to cost. And we are also going to know how many bags because we have 32 square meters, right? Okay. Let's start step by step. Let's start with him buying the tiles. How much is it going to cost for him to buy the tiles alone? So let's start the cost of tiles so that is buying the tiles that is going to be we have it here the said one box is 143.84 and he's buying 80 boxes remember we said 80 boxes in the previous question right so we're going to say now um cost there is equal to and then we're going to say 143.84 rands for one box multiplied by 80 boxes and that's 143.84 multiplied by 80. And that is 11,507 rands and 20 cents. And then we have... And then we have... Um, next up. So we've bought the box of tiles. Then we have the cement. Let's go get the cement. So if the cement says that... A 20 kilogram bag covers three meters squared and that bag costs 99 rand and 90 cents. So three meters squared, we need to find out how many bags first. So we need to know how many bags. One bag, right, will only give us three meters squared. Now remember we have 32 meters squared, right? So we have to get how many bags. We'll just calculate and find out. So I'm not going to do the whole thing. I'm just going to show you that I did this for this part. So now we're doing the cement, right? We did the tiles. Now we're doing the cement. Okay. So we're going to cross multiply. And in the end, we're going to get 32 divided by 3. And that is going to be... The answer there is 10.66667. So we're going to say, I'm going to say round off and get how many bags? 11 bags. We can't buy 10. It won't be enough. There's that bag that we're not going to finish, which is 0 0.6 part of it. We need 11 bags. Now, how much is the cost here? So one bag is... 99 rand and 90 cents. How many? 11. Let's find out. 99.90 multiplied by 11 and then we're going to get 1098 rands and 80 cents for the cement right and then we're going to go ahead and get the bags the tile grout they said she's going to need a total of four and uh, the uh, the tile grout add per bag, right? So per one bag is 890 and we're buying four. Let's do grout is equal to how much? 890 multiplied by four and we get that. 890 
multiplied by 4 is 359 rand and 60 cents and that is that okay so we're going to move on find out what other cost we have we have the cost of labor so my labor here is 2000 500 rent there's no hours or anything like that so that's the total and then that's just the money that she's going to use okay let's find out how much she's actually paying so the total cost is equal to start from the top the tiles there they are 11,000 11,500 and 7.20 plus uh the cement, which is 1,098.80 plus 359.60 plus the labor, which is 2,500. Right, so the answer will be 15,465.60. So it's not going to be enough, her money, because she has 15,000 rand. But then again, this could be an overcalculation. If you use area, it could give you maybe exactly 15,000. But as you can see, this difference is only about 400, 500 rand, right?